John 1 29 that the next day Jesus the next day John seeing Jesus Christ coming unto him and said behold the Lamb of God which taketh the sin of the world behold the Lamb of God he was standing before people and they saw Jesus and they screamed out behold the Lamb of God the Yoruba version we say is GSC GSC behold the Lamb of God life is all about recommendation life is all about recommendation and life is all about who you know or who knows you or who talks about you who recommend you to people so life is about recommendation if you see that book of 1 Samuel chapter 16 the verse 12 that we read now it says and he sent and he brought him he sent and he brought him now he was ruddy and without of a good countenance and godly and goodly to look to and the Lord said arise anoint him for this is the word amen nobody can attain some height some position in life without somebody recommending you there are some positions in life there are some places in destiny there are some places about your career that to attain will be difficult except by recommendation this week God will recommend you this week God will recommend you in the name of Jesus so you need recommendation from someone what is recommendation if you look at the English Oxford advanced learner dictionary it stated this way recommendation is to make somebody or something seems attractive or good it also means to tell somebody that something is good or useful or that somebody will be suitable for a particular job what are those keywords there telling somebody recommending somebody showing something is attractive and good presenting something faultless presenting something very useful that is the meaning of recommendation in the dictionary many of us today many people we are where we are today either by woman recommendations it's either somebody talks about you or somebody failed to talk about you so what we need is not just to be womanly recommended but we are talking about divine recommendations where God can use anything around this week you will be recommended this week you will be recommended in the name of Jesus Amen people want recommendations some people today are where they are either by divine recommendation or recommendation of what they call the Godfather even in the politics you will hear everybody want to go to politics there are some certain places they want to get to for them to endorse them for them to recommend them and say this one is the candidate this is my candidate let me tell you you may not have a God father is it? but you have who they call God the father it has the ability to recommend you anywhere God the father will recommend you in the name of Jesus the Bible says in that place we read now it says in that John chapter 1 verse 36 and looking at Jesus as he walk looking at Jesus as he walk behold the Lamb of God
Hallelujah. If you look at this place here, before that time, Jesus was not yet known by people. Before that time, nobody knows Jesus. Jesus was God on earth, but nobody recognized him. Nobody knew him. I don't know what you carry, but nobody knows you. But after this morning, this week, everywhere you go, you will be known. You don't shout that amen louder. You will be known. As many watching online, just type that amen. Engage your like buttons. Type amen. Share the program. As you share it, God recommend you. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Nobody knows Jesus. The people did not know him. The multitude of the city did not know Jesus. At that time. But when the time come, for him to be known. And God decide to show the greater glory of Jesus. What God brought Jesus to a particular man called John the Baptist. And when John the Baptist saw Jesus, and the God that commended Jesus to John the Baptist, and John began to say, Ah, this man is the Lamb of God, he is the one that took away. The sin of the whole world. You look at that place here. Jesus did not need to go for what they call publicity. He did not need a public announcement. And say, hey, 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 I am the one that will take away the sin. There are many times, anytime you should showcase yourself, people won't value what you carry. It is somebody that will recommend you to another person. And we are talking about divine recommendations. God will recommend you in the name of Jesus. So Jesus did not need to tell the people, I am the one. No, he didn't need that because God placed somebody. There is somebody God placed in a particular position that this week you will meet that person. It will tell you to the king in the name of Jesus. Somebody will recommend you. Somebody will recommend you. Somebody will recommend you. Divine recommendation will come for your lifting. In the name of Jesus. Talking about recommendations. God can use anybody to recommend you for your helpers. There are helpers around you. But God can use somebody and recommend you for your helpers. There is somebody I get to meet that is a helper, a, a, an angel. But somebody recommended me to him. Somebody will tell you to somebody. In the name of Jesus. So God can use anybody, anybody wishes to recommend you to somebody. So if God can use anybody, therefore you don't need to look down on anybody. You don't need to look down on anybody. Don't need that. You don't need to look down on anybody. If you read the Bible carefully, in the book of Genesis 49, Genesis 49, from verse 9 from verse 9 to 14 the bible mentioned very clearly that the chief butler recommended joseph to king pharaoh the king butler that chief butler he recommended joseph to king pharaoh before joseph became a prime minister there was a recommendation by a particular man that joseph met one day there are people you are meeting every day you don't know they are in like a step for you to get to a place of your destiny. You don't look down on anybody. You don't despise anybody. God can use anybody. God can use anyone. Somebody is getting help today. Somebody is getting help today. You are getting help today. In the name of Jesus. So before Joseph became a prime minister, somebody recommended him to Pharaoh. If you read the Bible carefully, in the book of 2 Kings chapter 5, verse 3, the Bible talks about a maid in the house of Naaman. A particular slave girl. A maid in the house of Naaman. He recommended Elisha to the master. I know a particular prophet. I know a prophet in Judah. I know a prophet is called Elisha. If you get to him, this is your shame we go. 
This your leprous will go. What is leprous? A reproach. It is a physical element. There are some reproaches in life you carry. What you need is an helper. The Bible says when the Bible says the king could not sleep because of somebody. He could not sleep because of Mordecai. God took away sleep. And he said, Give me the book of remembrance. And he was open the Chronicles book. Open it. And he saw. Because God wants to help somebody. He go there. He steered the heart. He said, I took away sleep. Your helpers will locate you this week. Your helpers will look to this week. So God can recommend you to your helpers. He can recommend you to people you people you don't know. God can recommend you to them. And people that do not know you, God can recommend you to them. You don't need to know them if God is in place. He shows you. God told the light that I'm sending you to a woman. I prepared a woman there to take care of you. They did not know themselves. They did not know themselves. <laughs> Amen. You will get help us. If you look at the book of First Samuel, according to the First Samuel chapter one, chapter sixteen. It's a very long scripture, but we're not going to read it here this morning. 4 Samuel chapter 16, from verse 1 to verse 13. 4 Samuel 16, verse 1 to 13. God recommended David to Samuel. God, he recommended Samuel. It was God that recommended David to Samuel. He recommended David to Samuel. And Samuel did not know David until God recommended David to him. He was a prophet. He did not know David. It was when God recommended David to Samuel. God was the person. And because God was the one that recommended David, there is a result that follows. There is a result that follows. What are those results? David was sent for. They sent for David. And what is the meaning? David received good news. This week, good news. Oh, you don't, don't, don't get it. You are not getting it. Good news is coming away. If it is you, you will shout more louder. Good news. Good news. Good news. In the name of Jesus. What are those results again? David was anointed several times in the scripture because he was recommended. Several times he was anointed. If you look at the book of 1 Samuel chapter 16, 13, he was anointed. In the book of Psalm 89, verse 20, he was anointed. If you read the Bible, 2 Samuel chapter 2, verse 4, he was anointed. 2 Samuel chapter 5, verse 3, he was, he was anointed several times. And because of that anointing, David became an object of envy. Everywhere he go, they envy him. Because of the anointing, they envy him. Everywhere he get to, it became an object of envy. Because God recognized him. By that anointing, it became untouchable. The Bible says, touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Oh, 5 verse 15. Psalm 105 verse 15. Touch not my anointed and do it became untouchable because he was anointed. He says they move from one kingdom to another, from one nation to another. He permitted no one to do them wrong. He removed kings for their sake. And he says, touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. What another result? David changed position. He changed position. He changed position. David was specialized. He was known to be in the kingdom, animal kingdom. God changed him from animal kingdom and they brought him to become a ruler of men. He began to rule. He began to take dominion. Somebody is here this morning. God laid in my heart that this week, this week, you will be recommended and your position will change. In the name of Jesus, your position will change. David was changed from the kingdom, animal kingdom, and what is sat on the throne 
But God recommended him. It does not matter the position people have not attained in your family. But by the reason of this morning, by the reason of today's anointing, I speak in the name of Jesus. You will get to a seat nobody has ever sat before. Because God is recommending you. In the name of Jesus. David began to rule. He began to take dominion. God wants to recommend you. But hear very well. Be very sensitive. You have a role to play. All those God recommended, they were active. They were very effective. God does not use lazy people. If you are lazy, you fold your hand. This can work. This can work. See, the eyes of the Lord, it goes all around. He's looking for them that are working upright. His eyes is moving. If you see them, I've seen. He saw. He told the devil, Satan, Satan, have you seen my servant Job? Have you seen Job? He was recommending Satan, Job to Satan. Because God wants to show his strength. Somewhere in the book of Job, chapter 1, verse 6, verse 8. He was recommending him. So, you don't need to be lazy. In the book of Proverbs 22, verse 29. Don't be lazy. Don't be lazy. Don't be lazy. We are about to pray now. What am I saying in a nutshell? Let God recommend you. Let God recommend you. If God recommend you, your story will change. Stop looking for mass recommendations. Let God use someone to recommend you. Let God recommend you. If you see that place you read in that book of 1 Samuel 16 verse 12, he, 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 he says, and he sent, and he brought him in. He sent, and he brought him in. Now, he was moody, with without of good countenance, and goodly to look to. And the Lord said, Arise, anoint him, for this is he. God, let God, let God. When God wants to recommend you, the, a, a slave girl called Esther in the Bible, everywhere she went to, she was favored. Because she was more preferred than every other person, a slave. They saw the beauty. Because it was God's recommendation. Let God recommend you. If you look at the book of Genesis 41, Genesis 41 verse 14, uh, it says, Then Pharaoh sent and called Joseph, and they brought him easily out of the dungeon. Somebody will leave prison today. You will leave that position now. You are leaving that sick bed now. You are leaving poverty now. Yeah. They brought him out of the dungeon. They are dungeons of life. They are dungeons of life. Go to a year. And they brought him not slow, slow. Passed with haste. Before 24 hours. I prophesy as a son of a prophet. Before 24 hours, your helpers will not rest. They will send to you. Why, Joko? Only Joko, we are not going to sit until they come. We shall not sit until they comes because it was God's command. And they sent, they brought him out. You are leaving prison now. You are leaving prison now. You are leaving prison now. You are leaving that position now. Sit down one minute. One minute. And they brought him out of the dungeon. And he shaved himself and changed his remnant and came unto Pharaoh. Why? Because it was God's time. God, remember, and they brought him from the prison. That is what they call divine recommendations. When God recommends you for a position that you never think you want for. And let me tell you the secret now before we pray now. Anytime God recommend you for a position, He will empower you for that position. God's recommendation comes with empowerment. God says, Behold, I give unto you power to trade upon 
of Second King, chapter 3, verse 14, and we read now. Two kings, two kings, the king of Israel and the king of Edom, they received divine recommendation by Jehoshaphat. By Jehoshaphat. For them to receive miracle. For them to receive miracle. They received that divine recommendation. And that miracle is what? For them to defeat the Moabites. There are things you cannot defeat. Or come out, don't confront your telling. By the reason of this morning, Jew, you are moving now to get a success. Shout! Yeah, you shout. Oh God, my Father, recommend me to my helper. Recommend me to my helper. Anointing for favor. Oh, yeah, shout them. Pray. In the name of Jesus. Recommend me to my helper. I need your recommendation. Shout it, shout it, shout it. Let God show you to the world. Let God show you to the world. Regardless of what you possess, even Jesus, it will join the Baptist that announce him. Oh God, showcase me to the world. Recommend me today. Recommend me today. I need your divine recommendation. I need your divine recommendation. Divine recommendation. I need your divine recommendation. Hallelujah! 